I'm actually biased in the sense, not in the sense that I prefer one option over the other. It is more meta. Is that I always prefer to be consistent. So whatever I decide, I'm consistent on this decision. So I know my thought process. That if I start in the content, na 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 na, comma, what is? Hey, that was done on purpose. That means uh, what I ask has some nuisance already. It's not just, hey, give me the definition. Or I have other cards and I'm specifying more. And in this case, I will start like this. Depends on you. At the beginning, no worries about this. Just ask in plain English or the language you, you may use. But after, in my case, 15 years, then I realized that I can, um, the time investment on flashcards is reduced uh, by the consistency in, in the formulation. So even if, even if I have forgotten why I created this flashcard or the answer, at least it's more, I can communicate better with my previous self because there's a lot of implicit and embedded information that is not there. And I know from my previous self. Perhaps I have different iterations of that. That I, Let's say I created this, I don't know, four years ago, not just last year. So before I predate this convention, this happens, that in my collection now I have different stages of the same convention, or different conventions coexisting, this is also the case. So I have to co communicate with my previous self of one year ago, several years ago, pa pa pum. That means that if I will see no information, I only see the text, sometimes, based on the formulation, I can already assess, hey, it's, them, it's from this generation. When I was like that, oh, that was uh, from December 2020 and March 2021 in this scope. Because I divide these generations of my previous self, I split qualitatively those eras or generations of my previous self and with this technique, it's so easy. It's like, hey, I have to talk with this person, uh, John, Andrew, what the, whatever uh, names, it's just an example. Because they are your close friends, you know, more or less how they uh, think, the vocabulary they use. And explain this to that person, to Andrew. I, I will be like this. I will phrase it like this or like that. So you adjust your words to that person, your friend of yours, because you already know right so it's this thought process but with c copies of your previous selves of yourself not just one previous self and that's it they are like degrees this is massive this already helps a lot and i have made the data so i can actually verify with condolence of age oh yeah 2020 uh december or no october oh yeah makes sense so I still have made the data I can rely on. So it's, uh, it makes this a lot uh, easier.